Welcome to Meerkat Musings Mario Maker, video number five. The first few didn't have any voice. And I'm not sure what joke my wife just made. But she's sitting there having a gill fit. So you might hear some giggling in the background as this progresses. Especially if I sound smashingly nice. I'm not sure. Okay, she's gone again. I apologise in advance for any, any, any unexpected giggling that may happen. So, what I'm going to do for this particular video is take a look at some of the levels I've seen played by other people to make these videos, including the levels sent in for the entertaining Mr. A game. If you like this sort of video, then I urge you to please take a look at his, because it's hilarious. Uh, especially hilarious given some of the really nasty levels that people have sent him to play over the past couple of years. Levels that I'm going to attempt myself. Now having seen how difficult some of these levels are, I am probably going to fail miserably at these myself. But, why not? So we're going to have a look, and because I like the way this one sounds, Self-Destruction Initiated. A level called Self-Destruction Initiated sounds very entertaining. This level has an 11.31% clear rate. The world record is 37 seconds. By... I can't read that. Mechina might. So we're going to give it a go. We're going to see how epically we fail at this. And as I say, you may pick up on some unexpected giggling and laughter in the meantime. We shall see. Here we go. No. Well, that was intense. Run! Oh. <laughs> wow. This is insane. Insane, but absolutely brilliant. That was crazy. Ah, just outside the world record. Still, that was a very, very good level. And I think it shows off the skill and genius of some of these makers here, because I, for one, certainly could not come up with a level like that. Not in a million years. I have got a few levels on, on the game, but nothing like that. Nothing like that for sheer, absolute genius. So, we're going to take a look now, what else can we find that I know has been quite good fun. A game's about impossible levels, so this was no doubt one made for him with the intention of being nasty. A 1.29% clear rate. Wow. Zept, you are clearly a cruel, cruel person. But we will see what your level is like. Okay, straight away, that's evil. 
I was about to die. Probably. Oh, no, he didn't. But I can't get out. Okay. Oh, no. It's one of those levels, isn't it? Uh... Oh, I even knew they were coming as well. Fish! Fish, 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 fish. fireball. Do, do, jump! Oh no! This may. Oh, again. This might take a while. Ah, oh, I forgot about those again. Ah! Oh. To quote my wife, Dave is not amused. I can't go in the pipe either. Oh, good. Well, we made progress, sort of. Ah, oh, we did that. How many more goes to give this before I just think, you know what? I've had one. But because I'm a glutton for punishment, I'll we'll probably have a few more. Ah, hello. I think there's those arrows there before. Patience is required here, I think. I'm getting myself into a panic. Jump up here, hit the block, and let me die. Ooh. Uh. Oh. Ah. Oh. Okay, I'm going to admit defeat on that one. That is a horrible level. So, what else can we look at? What is going on on this one here? Boss Hard J by Cool Jake. It looks insane. 6.69% clear rate. 36 second world record. Look at that! Look at the thumbnail, that looks bonkers. Okay, flaming fish. I do not like fiery fish. Unless it's fish that I've personally taken the time to deep fry. Do, do. What? Oh, wow. That's a lot. Okay. 
Loads of magic. These guys are supremely annoying and there are millions of them. Oh my god. Oh my god. What cruel and evil person. Okay, there's a mistake to try and run through there. I mean, why? I've probably seen Mr. A game play this video, play this level. I don't remember it. What worries me is that pipe probably leads right back to the beginning. You've got to be slightly careful as to where you go. Oh, no, I haven't. Oh, no. Oh, really? Oh, that's unbelievably cruel. Oh, dear God. I can't believe I got that close and died. And that was just amateurish. And that was even more amateurish. Well, you know, if the maker of this level had a really good ratio, then I have an even better one, I think, for how tough their level is, because I am wrecking up the diffs like no one's business. Especially by doing things like that. Here we go again. I'm wondering if that's a clue of some kind. Nothing up there. Is there like... Oh 
Okay, I think we're going to have to admit defeat on this level. It's getting a star because it's insanely fun, but it's one I might have to come back to, but not right now because that's absolutely bonkers. And how many camics did you have there? That was crazy. So... Let's see... What other unique levels have been sent in over time to test Mr. A-game. Clearly people like sending him very tough, very awkward levels. I guess that's because it's entertaining to watch people fail at those levels. I, for one, certainly seem to fail these more often than I succeed. Wow. So the latest level is Pink Coin Panic by Andrew. Today's background music is brought to you by my loving wife. Oh no. Oh no. I'm sure I need that coin. But I don't know how to get it. <laughs> or rather, I think I do know how to get it. It's just going to be really difficult. <laughs> okay. Got the coin. Still died. Um, what? Okay, I'm going to see if we can do something about the coin. Not like that, can't obviously. This is a pretty bad idea. I'll start over. I'll quit. This is a sort of level which is designed to annoy me. So let's have a look instead then. For a second. Let's go back. Let's take a look. Some of the highlights lately. So we have a few levels to choose from. Let's see. Twilight Princess HD by Tough Ninja. A 29% clear rate and a world record of 12 seconds. So it's just one of those levels where you can just run and hope for the best. We shall find out. him but at least he's had to go see come fight hello baby bowser I'll say bowser Jr. Doo -doo -doo. 
Whoa! And that was me being careless and not paying attention. You know what, we're going to take our time over this. I'm not going to worry about wood records. We're going to concern ourselves with one thing and one thing only. Which is finishing the level. Catch me! Whoop. But I can kill you! Ha 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 ha! I don't know how someone beats level in 12 seconds. Now, Big World, as you can see scrolling down there, looks quite good. So does Pepper J's Shipyard, but we'll start with Big World. Which looks to have been beautifully drawn, with quite a lot of attention to detail there. By Danny. Oh! Oh good. Giant Gumba. Haha, -ha. let's chunk out its brain. And got punished by Cooper for doing so. Okay, that's right. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, Mario. Art score. Importantly, power up. So this is a giant. What is that? Don't know. Really. That's a giant star man. Coins go. That's how those moon things. Coins go. Lots of one ups in this one. Generous. That's a piranha plant. And that's the end. Okay. Let's land this thing. Okay. Time. Very colourful, very pretty, and quite good fun. World record of 25 seconds. I was a bit slow. Story of my life. I'm intrigued by this one, Galumba Castle. We'll take a look at this. 22% clear rate and a world record of 41 seconds. Can we come remotely close to the world record? More importantly, can we actually finish the level? Now, I'm guessing straight away, we need to hold on to a Goomba here. Because they're going to be the key to 
grabbing things. Wow. Don't know what that did. Agents of bowels, I don't forget. So they are, in fact, pure evil. So we have to go in one way. Design levels actually quite beautiful. So we can go up here. What's up here? The checkpoint. Ah. Always worth getting a checkpoint. Didn't really need the mushroom, but we'll hold on to this. You might need this. And indeed, we do. So only a chance we've got to get into the coin. And a white mushroom. Oh, thank you. Look at the size of that Goomba. All of that to click the keys, and we didn't really even need to. Strange. But, a good level. That wasn't overly challenging perhaps, but nonetheless clever use of the Goombas. Next up, Big Boo's Haunt N64. Hmm. Why not? Why not? By Andre GX. Let's take a look at your level. Okay, first things first. A Boo. Now the Boo's were first introduced into Mario games, as it happens, by Super Mario 3, which happens to be the tile set this one is based on. And I dare say, I've always thought Mario 3 had 
some of the best aesthetics of any of the Mario games. I have no idea what's going on here. But then I think this level was intended to be a bit peculiar. If it's like one of the proper ghost house levels, then the proper ghost house levels were always a bit twisted in the Mario games, I mean, especially Mario 64. Oh, sorry, Mario, um, Mario World, Super Mario World. That was a very strange set of ghost house levels. Some of which were very, very challenging, not even because they were hard, but purely because they were confusing. There's a lot more of these than I gave them credit. Okay. Can't go that way. You can't have less convinced there's no way to go there. You have to take a leap of faith. It's always a little bit nerve wracking in these games. Progress once again. This time we're not going to get shot to pieces by the cannons. I'm trying to maintain the advantage of being big Mario. From the Progress is good. Oh boy. Oh, we just pull them out. Ah, that one's got wings. Oh, that was a real scary moment there. That was a very good level with some good ideas. Let's go back to the main menu and see what else we can find to enjoy. Super Smash Brothers The Sequel Quiz Party Show me your Cree something something. Right. 
Super Metroid. Impossible. A level called Impossible sounds interesting, so we'll give it a try by Owen. 29% clear rate. Maybe not quite as impossible as they're led to believe. And a world record of 14 seconds. Is it truly impossible? Let's find out. We have big figures. Show Bowser, I have no time for your shenanigans. Although, I know from my past experience with these levels, Bowser tends to come after you, so I'm not going to look at her. Now I'm going to get a bit of a move on. Oh, wow. Well, I have to say it wasn't actually impossible at all, by any means. So I think we're going to do two more levels before we cut this video short. So we have, let's have a look. New arrivals, we're going to take a look at. We're going to take a look at some new stuff, some new levels. For the last two rounds. Four rooms by Tub, Tube. We'll have a look at your level first. Three doors and a pipe. We're going to do pipe first. Boy. Oh wow. Um. Hey, have a key. Door number one. Oh no. Oh, that's mean. Okay. Middle door. I see. No time to do anything. So that strikes me as being somewhat unfair. It's asking you to do this in some kind of order. Oh no. This is quite a tricky level. Because now we have to do that again. So 
But I think three of the coins are easily gettable. The last one, I'm not sure about. A key. someone more talented than me to, to deal with that. So last one for the time being. Sinks Swamp Chase. Let's take a look at this. Now, is a thwomp chasing us or are we chasing a thwomp? Good, come on. Moles, as we know, being Austin Powers, arch enemy. Mole. Oh, look at that one. Two of them. Chasing after me. Oh, good. Oh, oh go on. Stay on top of those things, I'll be alright. Oh my god! Wow. That was only 44 seconds. We'll do one more level. Just the torchy wall. Not a normal day for Mario by Yap. Let's have a look. This is like Blimey. Right then, well, that concludes Meerkat Mario Maker number five. So at some point, of course, 
there'll be a number six and there will also be other videos on the channel various things I'll try and do some videos around things like uh, Breath of the Wild on the Switch and what I'd like to do at some point as well is rig up the SNES Mini to this system so we can go through what is probably my favourite game of all time and I'll leave you to work out what that is although it's probably quite obvious if you look at the website you'll find that out pretty quickly so we'll go through that and maybe some other bits and pieces as well. well we'll wait and see meanwhile thank you for listening to me ramble on if you've enjoyed the video please hit subscribe if you want me to play any levels then please drop the ID code for the level in a comment in the comment section and I will try and get around to that at some point for you as well until then once again thank you very much for listening and until next time.